Troy Corsa. I'm riding the BMW 1928 supercharged compressor. It has 80 horsepower, but it has no suspension. It's a rigid frame uh, with the hand shift, four speed gearbox. The top speed does about 140 miles an hour, so yeah, fast enough. <laughs> A bit unstable in the corners, but uh, I've managed to ride the bike how I wanted want it. Uh, yesterday's race went really well. Unfortunately, I stalled the bike on the start from the race, so I was effectively dead last into the first corner. But I managed to get to the front and lead the race and change over to my, my teammate, who uh, was the very first time for him here racing as well. So uh, I tried to give him as much gap as possible. Uh, we managed to stay on the podium, so it was good. He will start the race this morning, so I'm hoping he can get away with the guys at the front. Uh, just be there, pretty much, and then uh, hopefully they can change over and uh, I can get out there and get us back to the front. For us out there, I don't take it too serious, but uh, once we all put our helmets on, it pretty much starts. <laughs> it's got a very unique sound to the engine compared to anything else. Obviously the supercharger, it, it revs quite well. Faster than any bike I've ridden here before, but the uh, suspension hasn't got any, so it's a little bit difficult to ride, but uh, we're doing the best we can. Friday was the first time I'd actually ridden the bike, so having to learn the hand shift gear lever, which is actually probably the most difficult thing for the bike. My teammate who rides the bike quite a bit, he actually lets go of his right hand and shifts with his right hand. I actually reach across and do it with my left hand. Uh, one, because I look, Normally when I'm back shifting, I'm braking and I don't want to let go of the brake. So, uh, and also accelerating, I'd rather just use the throttle. So uh, it's quite a different technique, but uh, the bike's quite stable. But I've got to be a little bit careful from going around the corners trying to shift gears. But uh, at the moment I'm just using third and fourth gear. So uh, trying to limit the gear shifts that I have to do on where. Uh, yesterday afternoon after the race, I went down there and stood around with the bike and had a few beers with everybody and uh, yeah, everybody's just blown away with the motorcycles here and I think because the, the, the racing's so close and you actually see the bikes moving a lot. This is I think about my ninth season I've been coming here now. Uh, every year I come I learn the track a little bit more. So uh, yeah, I'm hoping we can come back next year as well.